everybody. Welcome back to Talk Time. I'm so blessed to be able to have my friend, Mr. Dwayne. Hi, Mr. Dwayne. Hey, how are you? Good. Hey, <laughs> let me share good. this with you before we get into the meat of what we have to say today. First Peter 4.10 says, God has given each of you a gift from his great variety of spiritual gifts. Use them well to serve one another. You guessed it. Today we're going to talk about gifts and talents. And I just want to share a quick story, if that's okay, no, before that's we uh, cool. share all that you have for the world today. I just want to share that, you know, um, when I was a little girl, I'm not even a little girl, probably throughout my uh, my journey, throughout my, my all the way to my adult years, I didn't even think I had any gifts or talents. I went around thinking I wasn't good at anything or that I had nothing to offer. And it wasn't until I got into my late 30s or so that I knew that I was good at some stuff. And the funniest thing is not just one or two things, but several things that I have to offer the kingdom and other people that, that may need uh, love from God or, or whatever, whatever um, um, I, I function in at that time. But um, I just want to let you know today that everyone has a gift. Everyone has talents. God has given us all these things to use to bless others. And this is a, a good point for parents. Parents, if you see things, and which you will, God will show you things in your children, use those things to, or help bring those gifts and talents out, help grow those things. If they can sing, if they're a good athlete, get them in things that will help grow that gift so they don't be like me being almost 40 years old thinking they ain't got nothing good to share. So, all right, welcome again, Mr. Dwayne. <laughs> welcome. Thank you. Thank you for doing talk time. Oh, I appreciate you for inviting me. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Yay. Well, listen, I know you have a story to tell, but I just want you to tell the world your full name and tell them where you're from, where you're at now, and all that good stuff. Okay, cool. Well, hey, world. I'm Dwayne McClain. I'm originally from Detroit. Uh, me and my wife, we moved up here in 2008. Um, she was going for her degree um, in counseling. She got her bachelor's, now she's going for her master's. Um, so we're up here in Mount Pleasant, and we actually love it up here. Um, we're not going back to Detroit. We love the peace, the yeah. family oriented, and just a calm place to raise the girls and yeah. the kids. Really. Yeah. Um, so we love it up here. It's really cool. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> well, Dwayne, I want you to tell the world um, your story on how you discovered your gifts and talents. Okay. Well, actually, it's it's kind of ironic because I share similar stories with her. Um, I really didn't. I'm, I'm 31 now, but I really didn't know any of my gifts and talents back in the day either. Um, I really didn't discover it until I came up to Mount Pleasant. Um, I, uh, I used to serve um, at Faith Community Church on a janitorial service, um, just cleaning the church and just doing stuff like that. And for some reason, I don't know what it was, but... I think the Lord put it on my bishop, uh, Travis Hall's heart. Hey, shout and, out to Travis Hall. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, yeah. go ahead. No, you're good. Uh, but the Lord put it on his heart for uh, for me to join the media team. Hmm. I didn't even think about it. I had no idea. I mean, you see people do camera stuff, but you don't really think about it. And I had no idea, no desire before. But he, the Lord put it on his heart, and I joined. And I just started dabbling in it and learning stuff. He was teaching me stuff on how to do and, you know, what to do. And I mean, it just took off. I mean, it just, it was like a new fell in love kind of thing. And I just was just so excited about it. And God was giving me like ideas and different promos for the church and how we could do this and different like sermon titles, sermon um, wow. promos to like, you know, hype people up for the sermon. and all kinds of stuff. I mean, the Lord was just blessing. It was just amazing. And uh, so it, it, it kind of burst into that. And I was like, man, I could, you know, I could help other people, you know, with this. It's like, you know, I do want to help build a kingdom, you know, use the gifts and talent to build a kingdom. But I'm like, man, after the church, people would ask me like, hey, can you videotape? I got an adoption thing coming. Can you videotape that? I got a wedding coming. Can you do that? And I'm like, cool, sure. Because I was just so excited about it. So it kind of got birthed at church. And then after a season of fasting and praying, God gave me an idea to like start my own little kind of company. 
Um, mainly, and it's never really for profit, that never really was my vision for that. It was just to mainly be a source where people can get to. Um, not just the church people, <laughs> but everybody can, it's a, a state of point where everybody can reach out to me and be like, hey, call DLZ3 Entertainment, or hey, call Dwayne. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of where, you know, it burst um, uh, the idea to start like my own little like, Your own uh, company. Yeah, my own videographer. That's deal. awesome. And let me yeah. just say too, yeah. um, <laughs> and our stories are somewhat similar. I, yeah. I never knew, um, that I had any gifts in media or anything like that. All I knew is I love to get in front of a camera and talk. <laughs> and I'm too learning things behind the camera as well. But, um, and it was the same thing in uh, my church. They really helped bring that gift out in yeah. me. So um, it, our, yeah. our stories are so much alike. Very now, similar. Mr. Dwayne, yes. please tell the world, what do you offer? What are your services that you offer the community? I offer the community uh, videography, photography, and web design. Wow. Yeah, it's really it's really been awesome. One one cool thing that I, I worked on, I don't know if you know Miss Keisha Brown. Oh yeah. yeah. I I was able to videographer <laughs> I was able to video her um, her story. Really? Yeah, that was such an awesome deal. And, and even that, the Lord ran out to church. She was like, the Lord told me you gonna um, we're gonna do some media stuff together one day. Oh. I'll never forget that. I'll never forget that. Oh. So that was one awesome thing. It was really cool. Um, just, I mean, God just used it in a major way. Like, I, um, I helped revamp, um, it was called New Hope uh, Organization. It's a young girl's uh, adolescent, or not adolescent, but young girl's home. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. It's right off High Street. Yep, yep. Yeah, I helped. They had a real old website. <laughs> and they entrusted me to like rebrand and refresh and wow. a whole new website. And it turned out really nice. It turned out Look really nice. Look what God will do. Yes. <laughs> yes. Awesome. Yes. <laughs> well, I am blessed to know this brother. We kind of met by accident. <laughs> and uh, the funniest thing is, I believe this actually wasn't an accident. I believe right. God brought us together so we can use our gifts to help bless other people yeah. now I um, I really uh, want people to know not only what services you have but is there a, a number or an email or a website that people can contact you yep all three actually <laughs> <laughs> all go ahead three. and share well you can go to my website at www.dlz3.com or you can give me a call at 989-854-2500 or you can email me at mcclainmediaguy at gmail.com. Wonderful. Yeah. Well, hey, I know you would want this awesome man of God <laughs> to do your, your videos, to do your, your pictures, or to help you create a website, which, by the way, you got to hook me up with that. I got you. I got you. I got you. <laughs> and uh, please give him a call because, uh, hey, God has put him here to help you. Now, I want to end by saying, people, know what God has placed in you. Know the gifts and the talents that he's given you because it is vital to um, help others. And not just to uh, give services, but I'm telling you, your gifts and talents could change people's lives. They really can. And um, don't think that you don't have a gift because you do. If you don't know what they are, start searching your heart for your passions or ask other people what they see in you. Because they'll tell you. They'll tell you. <laughs> All right. Happy blessed day. Thank you, Mr. Dwayne. Thank you for You're having blessing, me. Bro. I appreciate it. All right. Thank you for watching Talk Time.